gentlemen, and welcome to another episode here on Pastation of Skin. We're here for an Artifacts Monday. Yes, our friends from Artifacts Monday are continuing to release titles at a breakneck pace. And uh, of course, we've been covering them for a while here on the channel. And they've, I've always enjoyed, I enjoy myself a little hidden puzzle game. And this one is called Dark Arcana, The Carnival. Um, is it Dark Arcana, kind of The Carnival? Yeah, it's like Dark Arcana, The Carnival. And don't just check this dude out. Do, he doth tip his cap to us and make sure that the lady in the background, or me lady in the background, is actually <laughs> being attacked. This is going to be entertaining to play. I'm looking forward to checking it out. Um, the Artifacts Monday series have been super interesting in the way they managed to pull off a, um, a hidden object game while changing up the mechanics where we're at with a match two game or with other stuff that you can do that kind of like breaks it up the experience and their narratives have always been interesting enough the only thing that i've actually had is an issue with them is like their audio levels they just seem to actually just not care about audio mixing at all which is um something that i can identify with because you may notice that i've started trying to play background music while we're playing starting into games but yeah uh darker canon the carnival let's check it out there's no reason to delay let's start off our artifacts monday experience <laughs> right Dark Account of the Carnival from Artifacts Monday. What do you got to show? Look, a Dungeons and Dragons ride! <laughs> mother and child walk in, only the mother walks out. Don't be afraid, my child, it is not real! <laughs> Don't show my face, because I will be the killer. Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> it was exactly what I predicted! I'm sorry, I'm actually adding sound effects to this game even though they don't need them. <laughs> so Dark Arcana, the carnival. So what we got to check out in this one, obviously as always with uh, the Artifacts Monday games, this is not a single game. Nearly always they have a main game, a secondary game that you play afterwards, which is uh, the full narrative. <laughs> and I love the big sparkly lights for the unlock symbol. Uh, let's check it out here, just go in the options, uh, make sure that the music level, uh, sound level is up, music level is down a tiny bit because they always seem to have an issue about their audio mixing. I'm just making sure that I'm not as bad as well, just get, checking my levels as well. Brightness, turn it up, we touch for you guys to be able to see. There we go. It makes it a little bit easier for you guys to see on screen. And yeah, we're just going to jump straight into this. So obviously there's the carnival and last chapter, always unlocked after you complete the main game. Let's check out the carnival. So casual expert, <laughs> casual, <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a filthy casual to Artifacts Monday. I am becoming an expert, but I'm only entertained by it. Are we playing as the kid? No, oh, no, no, the kid's the only survivor. All right, so we're, are we a cop that's just arrived? Okay, let's find out. Please, can you find my mommy? No, no kid. Detective. The park's on lockdown. Girl's mother disappeared without a trace. Usually it's the other way around, but this case has been weird from the get go. I had a bad dream about a very evil place, and now my mommy is lost. That's not a good sign, kiddo! This woman's name is Susan Jones. I'll keep her daughter in my personal custody while you interview this so-called manager. He's waiting for you. At least he better be. <laughs> I'm sure he will. Oh, she was carrying a photograph of her mother! That's so... Oh, oh, that's, that's actually mildly upsetting. I want to end a ride with your mother. What? Wait, sorry, no, never mind. None of this. Susan Jones, the poor girl's mother, is missing. I have to help her. I'll make sure to write this down to my trapper keeper. I'm just going to skip the tutorial, all right? Yay! Hey! I was just wondering because essentially, like most of the times I'm playing this, I end doing the tutorial and it slows everything down a fair bit. What the fuck was that? Dude, you're an ass butt! Oh, look! That Pokemon Go! Zorlax! I don't have any coins. So, take a booth? Wait, what? 
Oh, right. We're having to find things. Uh, um, um. There we go. We got the coin, the button. We need a necktie. <laughs> Alright, what am I looking for? Tassel, ticket, eye, tea bag, giraffe, feather, keyring, necktie, necktie. Mustache! Ah, I was like looking there and like, there's no mustache being requested, but I found an eye. Alright, let's see here. Uh, elephant, elephant! Uh, keyring, 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 keyring. Oh, necktie, there we go, right there. Uh, keyring? Yes, a Don't need any of those. Tea bag? The fuck? A tea bag? No, it's fake tea. The tea bag. And a giraffe. And we need a tassel, a ticket, and a feather. Well, there's a ticket down there. And there's a tassel, tassel, ticket, feather. Tassel, ticket, feather. Tassel, ticket, feather. Tassel, ticket, tassel, feather. Alright, so we're just done to tassel and feather. Um, where is the feather? The glove. Uh, so you know we're at the point where I'm just gonna actually press and run for things. Oh, you son of a! I fucking hit that. I hit it whenever it's so close to the actual edge, and that was me wasting a goddamn uh, hint. So I need to wait for that to recharge if I can't find this tassel. Uh... Where am I not looking? Oh, my brain is... You fuck! <laughs> Use vibe button. button. Alright, so if I go in here and I throw the button into the 5 cent slot... Hey! You will meet a tall, dark stranger, but beware, he is the one you should be afraid of. It's not a very strange prediction, it's almost exactly what's going to happen. We saw the dude, he was already creepy. Can't interact with it, so... We can just go in here. Ah, oh, we need the item to be able to get in there, okay. So We have to go and chase after his body! Ah! Oh! You coward! Come back here! Do you seriously? I can climb that fence! Why is he running away? And why did he drop the key? Because he wants you to follow him! Obviously. Alright, throw some coinage in there. Which toy might come in handy right now? I don't know. I'll come back to you. No idea what I, I like. I don't know what toy I need. Hey, Chippy! What the fuck up? All right. So what will what what would count? Is there a banana in here? Wait, I saw a banana on the outside. Oh, there's a banana right there. Pick up the banana. Pick up the fucking banana! Hey, fucking banana! Give me that fucking banana! Right. What? Unbelievable! The reflection has changed. It did change and then changed back. Okay. Have a banana. The monkey's showing its foot, so now I can unchain it. Yeah, you can get the hell out of here now, Chipper. You run away. You have fun. <gasps> oh, we have a chip! Oh, he's our friend now! Oh! Oh, nose! Oh, oh that's, that's so sweet. Alright, you go get that. Go get that, Chipper. 
Good boy! Good boy! He's a good chimp. Alright, so what do we do with this? And um, key? Alright, we need that. Uh, obviously, we need to put the lock into it. No, we can't use that. Okay. Two booths are closed. Okay. So we have to get a ticket somewhere around here. Right, we need to pick that up. And right, we need to play this. Seem to be out of order? Well, obviously. Um, let's do something else. Uh, where are we going? Oh, we have to go all the way back? <clears throat> this is interesting. Oh, wait! Do I use the cocaine mall to get this? No. Wild Beast of Africa, 1976. Yeah, that is it. Oh, there we go. <laughs> this is really like, can I reach it? I want to reach up. Oh, wait, no, I just get the monkey to get it. <laughs> I thought for a second he was going to run off with the little shit. Alright, use that door handle. Boom! Wait, what? Uh, yeah, so Flandropies should be here. That should be there. Uh, <laughs> shit. Uh, dumbbell should be his. High in the face. Uh, bunny in the hat, though. Bunny in the hat. So, yep. Yeah. All right. Boom. There we go. Key in the door. Ah, key in the box. Jack in the box. Uh, button in hand. <clears throat> Sword swallower. No? Oh, that's, that's the pop of balloon. There we go. Pop in a balloon. That's going to be the eye. I will go in here. Closes the face, opens the door, uh, which then goes into his mouth. Anything I'm forgetting? Oh yeah, bunny in the hat. Hey! And the door opens. Oh, that's kind of cool. Oh, I thought it was the mechanical bird from, like, the, um, Pop one, but no, it's a creepy fucking alternate dimension. What the fuck? Get out of the mirror! Get out of the mirror! Okay, too late. Oh, that didn't work. Susan Jones. Jim Gibbons strikes back 25 years after the horrific accident. The retired knife thrower and his newly formed company, the Carnival, returned to our town. I decided to revive my troops, says Gibbons, because the Carnival is my passion, and other than Alice, the only love of my life, I'll never repeat the fateful performance, though. Longtime readers may remember Jim's wife, Alice Baker. She was fatally hit with a knife during Jim's most famous and extremely dangerous act, the Blind Thrower. <clears throat> her, her. Hey, tickets for the Hall of Mirrors. That's what we needed. So, um, anything else in here of value? <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry guys, I actually need to clear my throat and get a drink of water in me. Woo! Mm. Alright, that's lubricated. <clears throat> Mild lubrication. Novocaine for the so- Oh, there we go. The carnival map. No, I know where to find to search for Susan. So that tells us where we are, and we can jump back and forth between them. Hey! Oh, we have none to open that up, do we? No. Fuck, okay! There must be someone else in here that we need to look for. Oh, nice. Oh, very really nice. Okay, the one from 75 has gone missing. Is that the one that he actually like, stabbed his 
fiance with because it's kind of creepy that he kept the kept the basement in the keys. <laughs> Is that everything that we need to find in this room? Yeah, I think that's everything. All right. Yeah, going back. So I imagine now we got uh, yeah we got to go into the hall of mirrors because I got tickets for it now. Boom! In we go. Oh, this is terrifying. Come out of the mirror! Come here! Oh, shit! Run! That was no magic trick. Susan Jones really is trapped in the mirror. <laughs> Alright, we need to actually look around here. Um... I'm gonna take a look in this. Okay! This is gonna be fun! Right, so, Jack o Lantern? Oh, you have to do certain things to get to other things? Ugh. Get that. Uh, so, Broken Hammer. Well, that's part of a face. Um. Oh, wait. My Broken Hammer. No, Oh, there's, I'm looking at there's some of these where I have to actually like draw items to actually finish off a row, and I'm sitting looking at going like, yes, I do. I know I need to put someone in there, but I don't have any fucking chalk to do it with. Well, let's clear that shit out of the way and see if we find some stuff that we need. Oh shit! Um, yeah, open the box. We want to open the box. Or I could carve. Oh, that's just unnecessary. You're making me create the items that are on the list rather than actually just fucking showing them to me? Fuck you! Uh, see if the goggles. Uh, spinning top, spinning top, spinning top, spinning top. Broken hammer, spinning top. I don't have anything I can... What, what am I lighting with this? Lit lamp? Oh, there we go. Lit lamp. Are you... Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Hmm. Hmm. Alright. There must be a switch in here somewhere. Do I actually hit? Oh, it's fucking soap. And now I have to wait for the recharges for those ones. Oh, 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 oh you motherfucker. Oh, I'm not a fan of you. Oh, there's a switch. There we go. Lit lamp. Boom! Woohoo! Um, yeah, tic tac toe is the last thing I need to do. I'm trying to wonder where I'm going to find chalk for the tic tac toe. It's like hidden somewhere? Where is there, where is there chalk? Fucking hell, that is annoying! I hate it whenever it does that! There you go, tic tac too. Ah, uh, I got the teeth panel. There we go. Two out of four. That door is locked, and I can't go in there. So I have to go back. Um, I know what it is I need to do. I need to go in here, and I need to grab this, and I need to put this in here. So boom, that's that opened. Uh, awards, 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 performance of the year, Jim Gibbons, performance of the year, best circus assistant, Alice Baker, Oh, yeah. Right, one, left, four, right, two, left, one, or right, eight. Yes, I believe it will. Nothing else in there to grab? No, okay, we're gonna jump in here. There we go. And we need to use you. woo -hey! Alright, left, oh, god damn it. Reset. Right one. No. Right one. Left four. Right two. Oh! Hit that. Right, right one. Left four. Right two. Left one. Right it. Boom! There we go. 
Okay, that was probably the lock sorted. Sweet. Exactly. Oh, oh no. Not good. Not good at all. Not good news. Now we know exactly why he took her. So, she's an Alice lookalike. Alright, no need for evidence. We just need to save this girl's life now. Because we're pretty sure she is going to be used in a ritual to bring back a guy's dead wife. That's not a great combination. We don't want that. Uh, what, what was, in, was there something in here that was meant to actually be fixed? Yeah, well, we'll be back here, I'm sure. We'll be back. So, hmm? No, no. Yes, get. That's what I was looking for. Never mind. All right, so pop the lock on that, and then grab the key, and boom, we're in. No idea why we didn't just jump that fence. I know it's the mechanics of the game, but I don't know why we just didn't. Leave me alone! No, fuck you! You have this. You have a woman. You kidnapped a woman. Jim Gibbons. Again. Why does he keep rate? One hit and it's already broken. I should fix it before I try again. Uh, I need a screwdriver. Oh! Great! Damn! Did I find the healths? Shit! Alright, is, is there healths anywhere around here? Because I'm seeing non... Anything that butt helps. Yes, it does look like something broke into the carnival cabinet. Should we care about that? Or should we be trying to save this guy's life? I right, assume I need to come back here with the health. Oh, I've lost my monkey. Motherfucker took my monkey! We drop you. Drop you. Drop you. The only thing we're missing is an eyeball and a nose now at this point. Alright, so we need two. Whoa. Yeah. Go to the car cell. I need to find some shit. Oh, a screwdriver. Happy days. That's what we needed. I'm looking there going like, is that... Oh, wow. Slightly creepy. Yay, I figured out what that was. <laughs> I didn't know what it was. I was like, I'm just tearing limbs off of this for no reason. Okay, well that's all get it off and blocked, so can't do anything to that. So we have the nose now anyway. I just might as well throw you in there. Get this. I'm gonna do screwdriver on this, get it opened up. Boom! Spring in! Let's rock and roll! Slam, bitches! Ah! No, I want to pick up the thing. Okay. Well, that's creepy. Why, hello there! Detective. You don't understand. It's necessary. What the? Kidnap a woman, you fucking freak? Motherfucker! Alright, this isn't cool. Ah, puzzle fixing. Uh, root it. Yeah, that's not gonna fit. I've got an idea here. Is that actually up for up here? No, it's not. Right, let's try someone else. That's gonna be a little bit easier to re <laughs> rationalize. It's gonna have to be a flat top somewhere. That. That's gonna fit in there. And that's going to fit in there. And that's going to fit in. Whoa. No. In there. And that's going to have to fit in here. Boom! We fixed the window to another world! 
Jesus! Oh, fuckhead! Fuck off! So you would like to pass through the mirror, yes? Yes, please. Do you know that the mirror world is a very dangerous place? Who gives a shit? I eat danger for breakfast. Give you the token? Alright. Now you can see, fucker. Say hello. Hi! Okay, you creepy bastard. Oh, it's a mirror version of the world. Okay, well, we saw that from previously. Weird version of the game. Okay, that works for me. So now we can go into the other carnival world. Susan, come here and let's get the fuck out. Come on. Just keep running! Son of a bitch! Time to go through the looking glass. Now who would live in a carnival like this? Ah! Right, well that was actually the final thing that we needed to do before we actually went in, into the carnival world to actually explore the scary explorations that Artifacts Monday had us to do. So yeah, as always, Artifacts Monday are entertaining games. They actually have a, a charm to them. Uh, that I actually I find engaging and I hope you guys actually enjoy them too. Uh, as always, Artifacts Monday will return again whenever I find another Artifacts game, or Artifacts Monday game to play. Um, I'm sure there's a couple more that actually I've seen released recently, so it won't be too long until you see another one of these. But I want to say thank you very much for actually sticking through and watching with me as we played through Artifacts Monday's Dark Arcana, the carnival demo. Uh, this has been good fun, and if you actually want to see more of it, if you want to see more about these games, then make sure to comment and tell me underneath. I do not know what you guys want to see unless you tell me. Tell me if you want to see more of this or if you would like to see more of any other kind of games like this. Or do you have any suggestions? That's the more important thing. Do you have suggestions of uh, hidden object games that are available on console or on PC that are actually worthwhile checking out? Because this is a whole genre that actually doesn't get really well represented, but is extremely fun to play through. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. If you want to see more stuff like this and many more things besides here on the channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button. And if you're not a subscriber, well, that's okay. I completely understand. I don't worry about it. It's okay. I understand. Some people, it's just it's just not what you do. But what I will ask you to do is memorize the name Pastiche of Skin because if you actually want to see more stuff by me, you can just type in my name into Google and you will find me. It's not hard to find me. I'm not trying to hide. It's very, very easy to be found by me, to me, to show me, to look at me. In some way, shape, or form. Yes, that was the words I was looking for. And if you happen to be watching this on YouTube, hey, there's going to be a subscribe button up there. There will be a playlist right here of Artifacts Monday Games. Over in the far side will be a most recent episode on the channel. And right here will be a thing for you. Yes, this video right here will be based on the things that you look at on YouTube. So if you've watched this video and there's stuff on my channel that would fit into the kind of things that you like to watch in general, and this was just a random chance you found this, then this is the next video you should check out because um, it's not my fault. It's based on your choices, it's your taste. So um, don't blame me if you don't like it. <laughs> so yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching. It's been an absolute pleasure. I hope to see you all again, and I hope to see you in the future many, many times. I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye.